hello and welcome back to my channel welcome if you're new today i finally have my apartment full tour are you ready we're going to start out right here at the entryway this is as soon as you walk in the door i did this little situation right here i have a little peekaboo window that looks into the kitchen from this little entryway area and the living room i find it funny to say entryway because it's like the smallest little space so i always think of an entryway as like much bigger and grand but it's an entryway nonetheless then looking straight ahead from the front door this is the first thing you see and there's a little velvet what is that velvet I had to put my little velvet pillow, not a pillow, pumpkin right here. I did change this up. So you're going to get to see actually two versions of my fall decor for 2021. This is the first one. And then later on in the video, I will show you how I switched it up. You got to let me know. You got, <laughs> you have to let me know which one is your favorite this way the first way or the second way so this is what i did for the um tv stand the bowl of all white pumpkins is everything to me i love it and as you guys know i did uh get into the whole wheat and that whole natural floral for fall this year so loving that now this is the other side of the tv stand i also switched this up as well so again definitely let me know what you think i was waiting on a lamp from kirkland for this side so you will see how i ended up using the kirkland's lamp i love it by the way all of these pumpkins a lot of what you're seeing in this video was part of my fall haul if you haven't seen that i will definitely link it and you'll be able to see where i got certain things from so here is the almost 360 degrees view from the front door of the first look the walls are a little bare i need to do something about that now going into the kitchen which is the second room i decorated for fall this is to the left of my stove I love this whole little setup super cute in my opinion just my little butter dish which by the way is from Walmart you saw the cutting board that's sitting on here in my haul video and then over here by the sink and my coffee station if you want to call it that right here to the left is a regular drip coffee coffee mate machine nothing fancy but i love that whole little setup it's so cute to me i love how that worked out and then here it is from a different view from that little peekaboo window from the kitchen into the living room I got this new tear tray from TJ Maxx. Actually, no, Home Goods, but TJ Maxx and Home Goods, they're basically the same, right? I love it. I love the whole natural wood. I always tell you guys, I'm so into that. I did change up the tear tray a little bit, and I will show you that in a moment. Here's my super plain table. Decided to go somewhat simple in the center. I do want to find a table runner. I have yet to find a table runner that I love. 
so still on the search for that kept the table setting the plate setting very very simple we do eat at this table it does get messy all the things so i didn't want to make it too cluttered and too much at all This Good Eats sign, you've seen it in other house tours if you've seen those before. I do have a playlist of those if you want to watch. I will link it. But that one is from Michael's. And this is what the kitchen looks like. Again, like I said, I do use my kitchen. We do live here. This is truly how my kitchen looks on a normal basis when it's not, you know, being used and there's clutter on the table. This is what I changed with the tear tray. Just put my little mortar little situation there in the middle on the first level and then moved over the candle on top and put that little candle i mean that little pumpkin in the front now back to the living room these florals are from hobby lobby the pumpkins are all from hobby lobby also some of them i actually pulled off of like those pumpkins on the stick i just pulled them off the stick and put them in there this little light up topiary stacked pumpkin is from Big Lots from several years ago. I also added a wreath. So as I went decorating, things kept being added as I found them in the stores. So I love this wreath. I put it in front of my pantry door. And this is what things look like from the kitchen into the living room. Here's the first side table. This table is right by the door when you walk in. And it's also the side that my husband sits at. So I try to make it as simple as possible, just in general, because I was trying to keep things simple, which is why I ended up switching things up because it just looked too busy by the TV before. And now here is the other side table on the other side. And now you're starting to see how I kind of switched it up. You're really going to see it on this side. Kept the olive tree out. I really love it. I don't see any reason to put it away. This pumpkin is everything. It's from Big Lots last year. It was my favorite thing I purchased last year for fall. Here on the couch, I have my little tray with my little setup. So I did move the little velvet pumpkin and the other cloth pumpkin to this section to kind of use more as throw pillows. I really love it like this way more than where I had it by the front door. And the throw is from TJ Maxx. And this is what this view looks like now. I added the chair. I added a little leather pumpkin. When I saw it at TJ Maxx, I had to have it. It was only $9.99. And that's when I just knew I had to switch it up. I wanted it over here. I wanted to kind of get things off the floor. And I just think this is such a much better look. You'll have to tell me in the comments, look one or look two. Would love to see what you guys think. I love it this way. You kind of get a glimpse of the lamp here when I finally got it. it by the way, if you order from Kirkland's, it, it literally took the full seven days for me to get the lamp. 
like it said anywhere from like five to seven days it took all seven days and now this is what this side looks like I've already took the throw that's in this basket out and put it by the olive tree put it over there by the baskets by the olive tree I like it much better over there I will put a picture on my Instagram so that you can see what it looks like now and I'll continue to do that throughout the season as I change things up I'll update on Instagram or maybe even in the community tab here on YouTube so you guys can see the little changes because everything just keeps changing just like a tear tray have you guys ever heard that a tear tray is never done and neither is like any kind of seasonal decor I feel now I also wanted to show you the pumpkins lit up at night with just this pumpkin the other pumpkin that's on the other side and that stacked pumpkin by the peekaboo window just those three pumpkins on at night gives it such a nice cozy vibe in here we are loving it And that is going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell so you won't miss any of my upcoming videos. And let's keep the party going by clicking on one of these videos right here on the screen. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.